And uh, I don't know if you've heard, but there's this little thing called uh, LRT uh, that's also uh, been on the agenda in this community for uh, a while. Um, we had an LRT task force formed under uh, John Dolbeck uh, seven years ago uh, within the chamber, uh, comprised of a lot of anchor institutions, um, a lot of larger employers, uh, uh, engineering firms, the uh, Home Builders Association, the Realtors Association, and uh, we spent uh, many years uh, consulting with uh, experts like McMaster Institute of Transportation and Logistics, uh, city LRT staff, uh, Metrolinx, uh, we read Rapid Ready, and uh, the MITL report. And after, uh, as all, after all was said and done, um, the, uh, the task force determined that uh, this is too great a business opportunity to pass up. And the business case for, um, for LRT is very strong um, uh, uh, for the members of the, uh, the LRT committee and the, uh, and the board members of this organization. Uh, we have now shifted, uh, uh, shifted focus and uh, we advocated for the project and now it's important to us that we do everything we can to mitigate the impact to the business community along the way and that we get to the end of the, uh, the process and as the mayor says, um, I look forward to that day when we uh, are able to say uh, we should have done this a lot sooner and uh, I know that that day will come with the help of, uh, of these uh, leaders within the community.